New Year. Happy New Year, everybody! <laughs> it is a new year. Gosh. January 1st. 2019. Two Man, where did 2018 go? I know, where did it go? <laughs> Crazy. Now we gotta remember to write 19 on everything. Oh, I know. That's always the worst, and it's a new year remembering to rem the change the year that when you're writing it. <laughs> yeah. Anybody else have for, that problem? For first month's always, uh, it still is. right in 18. It is, I know, right? Well, we <coughs> are in New Jersey right now. We got our delivery done yesterday in Delaware. I think that was the quickest we've ever delivered and got offloaded at that place. There was nobody there. Nobody there. Yeah, it was New Year's Eve, so <laughs> it was like we, we just delivered it in and out right yes, away. Yes, yeah, it was yeah, so it was easy. Super easy, and... And yesterday we didn't do much at all. We found a little hole in the wall truck stop to park at. Went and had dinner at TGI Fridays because that was the only place around. Yeah. <laughs> we were going to go see a movie, but we ended up not doing that because it, our, it well, our, we were going to go see a movie first, then go eat. We got an Uber, but the Uber driver took way longer than we thought, way so longer. we were going to miss the start of the movie. It's and... like he stopped at Applebee's to pick up his food <laughs> before picking us up. Yeah, I know. Oh my gosh. But we're at um, the Petro in Bordentown, New Jersey right now. Yep. We pick up our next load tomorrow. Yep, we're... Where are we picking that up at? JFK Airport. Uh, yeah. We'll tell you all about it tomorrow, the details. Um, it's probably going to be a hassle. <laughs> probably the worst place to do a pickup on the planet. I know. We have picked up there a couple times before. We have. And, you know, it's not somewhere we like to go, but it's a really good, good paying load, and we couldn't turn it down. Yeah. I mean, we were really close. I think from where we delivered to there is like 180 miles. 80 miles. And, and it's a 900-mile load, but it pays just crazy good. Yeah, it's going to a decent area, but we've already got a backup lined up after that, but that doesn't pick up till the following Monday. So that's way in the future, which we'll talk about later. Yeah. Where are we delivering to? We are delivering. We won't jinx it yet. We'll yeah, tell we'll you talk tomorrow. about tomorrow because we'll once be picking we get it, it up, up tomorrow. Yeah, once we get it up. Yeah. <laughs> we just finished showering and eating some lunch, and we're going to go to the blue. <sighs> <laughs> That's good. <laughs> oh, now we smell good, but the dogs don't and the truck don't. So. <laughs> I've been using this new bed bath. Is it? No, bath and body bath works. Bath and body works lotion and body spray. Ooh, fancy. It smells good. It does smell really nice. It and it lasts. It lasts. Like, it, it, later on, she'll just keep getting whiffs of me. Yeah. And she, it, 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 does it make you horny, baby? <laughs> the smell lasts. It's not just something you put on and then in five minutes you don't smell it no more. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> but I think we're going to go get the truck wash at the Truck wash, get all the road grime just washed off. Yeah. We're going to just get the cheapest wash possible. Probably get an undercarriage too just to get all that road grime, salt, sand stuff off the truck. Yeah. Because bad. you don't want that stuff sitting on there too long. You'll start getting rust and I know. yeah, it's not good for the truck. We've so. gone through some rain which got a lot of it off. Yeah, but not, yeah, yeah, yeah. It's yeah, not, but, you know, you still need to get it washed off. So yeah. we're going to do that. So we are going to go get a truck wash, move to a service plaza a little bit closer, uh, about 40 miles away from here, but it's closer up north. <laughs> there's not a lot of places to park. Not a lot of places. And we're fingers crossed there's going to be a spot there because a lot of everything's like looking pretty full. So. <laughs> I know. All right, let's go get the truck wash. All right, let's go.
Well, the headaches have begun. <laughs> and we didn't get a truck wash. They were closed. Yeah. <laughs> Which good for them for New Year's Day. Yeah, but I would yeah. I didn't think they would be closed, but they were. Wah, wah. Yeah. So we we called about the load. Because this place we're picking up out at the airport, they're open 24-7. We called about it, and apparently the customer has not paid their storage, <laughs> so they will not release the freight. Until that's paid. Until it's paid. We were going to go pick it up today. Yeah. They said, sure, come pick it up today if you want. But... You, you gotta, gotta pay. pay. You gotta pay one thousand six hundred and twenty-four dollars. Not. At, at first, she said sixteen twenty-four. I'm like, oh, sixteen dollars and twenty-four cents. Sure, I'll pay. I'll pay that for the customer. We're making such great money on the load. What sixteen bucks? Oh no, no sir. That's one thousand six hundred twenty-four dollars. I'm like. Uh, ain't paying that good no so we called the agent they're aware of it of course the customers off today new year's day so yeah, yeah. they're gonna get with them first thing in the morning and try to get it sorted out so we can get it picked up hopefully first thing in the morning we'll see we'll let you know what happens we're at the grover cleveland service plaza off the i-95 in new jersey and it is packed full it is all the other service plazas down there we we're watching them as we we're going by we we're like Oh yeah, oh, yeah there's, there's tons of spots. There's lots of spots. Oh yeah, they got spots over there. We should be good at the Gro Grover one. No. 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 There is one more that is closer to New York City, which is the Vince Lombardi Service Plaza. It's a huge one. Huge one, but and they're always full. They're always full, and it's just nasty. Every time we've gone there, it's just nasty. And there really isn't anywhere to let the dogs out there. Yeah. So we figured we'd just stop at this one. It's not that much further. It's only like 25 mile difference. Yeah. So. yeah. <laughs> Hopefully things will go a little smooth tomorrow. I don't know. We'll see. We knew taking this load, picking up at a, one at an airport and on two on top oh, of that yeah. JFK airport. I'm prepared for the headaches yeah. that, that this is probably not the last problem we'll have. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Chances are it's going to take the customer forever to get it paid. I know. Probably won't get out of there until noon tomorrow. <laughs> Um, we're going to be sitting there. We're going to be battling the New York traffic. So, yeah, there, there's so much more headache to come. That, yeah. But it pays good, so yeah. I'm happy with it. I'm, yeah. I'm fine with it, you know? Yeah, we're already prepared. We've done this enough to know what to expect. And yeah. It's when you do the first one for the first time and right. you don't have any idea. And then problem after problem after problem And happens. you're doing it for cheap. <laughs> yeah, that's what really makes you mad. But yeah, you that's, that's when it get, you start getting pissed off. <laughs> yeah. 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 Ooh, I did want to mention, let y'all know, those of you that don't, we have Peace, Love, and Expediting shirts. If you haven't checked them out, check them out. I'll leave a link up here that you can click and go to them and, and see them. We've got mugs, t-shirts, sweatshirts, and all the proceeds that we make off of those, we're going to be donating. Yeah. We've made, I think, about $230 right now. I'd like to get at least $500, and we're going to match that so that we can donate like $1,000 yeah. to a charity. Yeah. And we'll do a video and let you all know where we're donating it and stuff. But I want to thank everybody who has bought a shirt or mug or sweatshirt so far. We really appreciate it, and it is going to a good cause. If you've purchased a shirt or anything send us a picture we'd love to uh show it in a video and speaking of that there's a few that i have that i wanted to share if y'all don't know cinnamon and derek from truck and travel truck and travel yeah truck and travel go check them out subscribe to their channel they do hot shot they do excellent videos about hot shotting yeah, and yeah. they're such a sweet couple but cinnamon got her a peace love and expediting shirt so, represent yeah thank you cinnamon so much and then we've got Brad, Amanda, and their son, Mason, they've been following us for quite some time. They got a sweatshirt and a mug, so thank you guys for that. And then I wanted to give another shout out for Michael and his daughter, Jojo. Michael's been following us for a while, and he emailed us a while back asking about getting a child size peace love and expediting shirt for his daughter jojo because she watches and enjoys our videos with him also she is adorable she too. is so cute look Check at this it. girl yeah. <laughs> so we don't have kids sizes available to buy so what we did is we had one made and had it sent to her for christmas and she is so adorable in it representing that peace love yeah, and expediting absolutely. with them little cowgirl yeah. boots yeah so thank you guys and thank you to anybody else who has purchased 
yeah, anything yeah, yeah. and yeah send us a picture email it to us the crafty trucker at gmail.com because we'd love to share it in a video and if you haven't got yours yet go get one you That's know right. represent it's gonna go to a good cause yeah we're gonna double whatever the total amount that we raised for it and yeah and donate like, we still haven't figured out what we're donating yeah we're to still yet. it's still up in the air but yeah. um probably I, I i like the the chihuahua texas one yeah something I, that's I really close like to that home one. and yeah. for animals that's really and again yeah. it's a it's a big deal to us to donate to, to something one a good cause that we believe in that we love and that it's gonna go pretty much 100 percent to the cause at so. least 90 percent yeah yeah yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah so, so but we'll let you know of course once we do donate it but i'd like to at least get our sales up to like five hundred dollars so we can donate a thousand dollars i think that would yeah. be awesome yeah that'd be cool so i guess we'll quit rambling i'm gonna let the babies out let the babies we out we gotta walk them way over there to the grass area I know, but it is what it is it's <laughs> it's new jersey new york area the northeast yeah. <laughs> it's hard to find parking yeah I, and I, honestly, I don't even think that half of these people, the, these trucks here, there's no. anybody even in them. No. <laughs> it's probably local people or they've gone to hotels or, yeah, or yeah, something. Yeah. So, But that's okay. I guess we'll check up with you guys tomorrow and let you know what happens with the pickup. <laughs> cool. Peace. Peace. It's leading me home. It's coming down. Raining on me. Leading me home, it's coming down. It's leading me home. It's leading me home, it's coming down. Wednesday <laughs> from New York JFK Airport. Oh, we made it in. Yeah. We are at a truck parking area right now because it is 7.46 in the morning. Yeah. And we're waiting to hear about them paying the storage fees before yeah. we go yeah. try to pick this up. Yeah. Because there's no sense in doing that. <laughs> we'll get there and they'll be like, can't pick it up yet. So. Yeah. <laughs> and they don't get in until 8 central time, so we'll probably be here at least till 9 eastern time. Yeah. So. Yeah. We're, we found this little uh, truck parking. It's paid parking, of course. They charge per the hour, yeah. so. But um, we're here and we're like Yeah, right up the mile, road. Yeah. Right up the road yeah. from it, so. Yeah. Um, I guess we'll see what happens. <laughs> we'll keep you posted. Cool. Bye. <laughs>
Illinois. Illinois. Got yeah. a Landstar DOT inspection done. 120 days. 120 <laughs> days. Man, they, they, they were combing through everything. Yeah, they were doing a thorough inspection. They, they did a thorough inspection. A lot of these places, you go in, they check your lights, and they're like, okay, you're good. Yeah, yeah uh, he, was, he was going over everything, which is good. Then we know everything's good. Did that, had, had some late lunch, early dinner. Yeah. And we have a load lined up, but it doesn't pick up till Monday. So we will talk about that in the, no, not even in the not next in, vlog. Cause we're yeah. going to end this vlog here. Yeah. We have some plans for over the weekend yeah, before our load picks up. So yeah, the next vlog go. will be those plans. We're going to go camping. Yeah. We're get away, go, get, go, go to, go enjoy some nature and get away from, uh, the butt hustle and bustle. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we'll just go ahead and end it because this right. is probably really long already. But thank you guys as always for watching and subscribing. Until our next video. Peace, love, and expediting. <laughs> what? What's going on? It's so cold. They just went out and buddy. Oh my gosh. Now they want their treats. Oh my gosh. Where's my treats? Where's your treat? You filmed the video humorous. without giving us treats. It's humorous. It's humorous. <laughs>